Hello, 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 everyone, and welcome back to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming. Thank you so much for joining me today in Mini Metro. We are going to be checking out the city of Montreal, and we'll be managing our metro to connect all the islands of the Montreal Archipelago. And it looks like last time I played, I got 1,029. Let's see if we can beat that score here in Montreal. So as always, let me give you a very quick introduction to the game. Pretty simple game. You just got to connect the stations with different subway lines. Move passengers from the station they spawn at to the, the corresponding shape that they are. So triangles to triangles, circles to circles, squares to squares. Pretty straightforward. But as some of our longtime viewers of this channel or of this series know, things get crazy pretty darn quickly. Uh, and it can get, it can get messy. Especially when, you know, you run out of tunnels and you're trying to get over to an island to get to a station and mm, not fun at all. The nice thing about this game, though, is at the end of each week, at the end of every Sunday, you do get to get some more prizes, whether that be a new line, new trains, new carriages to extend the sizes of your trains, uh, bridges, tunnels, whatever you need, you can get them from the game. Okay, here we go. We got a nice triangle there. We'll hook our orange line into. Looks like the week is almost over. We're about halfway through Saturday and we've moved 25 people so far. And uh, this green line seems to be spawning quite a bit of people, especially these two circles in the northwest corner. And here we go. We're going to hop over of our orange line and grab that circle on the other side of the river. End of the week. Uh, we'll take a carriage and let's go ahead and put the carriage on the the green line. Oops, on the green line here. There we go. So now he'll be able to carry 12 passengers instead of the six. Uh, that makes our lives a little easier there. And he's going to drop those triangles off there directly south. And we have another circle spawning in. Uh, let's just take our yellow line and we'll get our yellow line hooked in like that. So we have a nice... Uh, yellow green orange uh spaghetti going here and ooh um let's see let's wait to the end of the week if we can get another line i'd like to hook into that yellow line up there except it's going to start chirping at us so for the time being we'll hook the yellow in like that and he'll have to run up there and grab ooh that one's spawning quite a bit um yeah we're going to definitely need a second line um let's unhook the yellow for now uh, nope, we want him to stay there, and then we want him to go there, and we'll have the green go up and hit that there. All right, that's a little more organized. We got a triangle spawning down there. We'll take the green off this triangle and have the green pick up that one, and we'll take the line. Oh, a nice pretty blue line there. Let's go ahead, since we got extra trains, we'll put an extra train on the yellow line. Seems to be spawning quite a bit, and our green line seems to be spawning quite a bit as well. So we'll get that train going there. 130 people move. Tuesday of, uh, I think this is week three. I can't quite remember, but that's okay. Since you guys are here, don't forget to like the video. Subscribe to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming if you want to get all this great content on time and in an orderly fashion. Oh, looks like we have our first special shape spawning in there. Yellow uh, is picking up that teardrop there. Uh, we might get... Let's get orange involved. We got plenty of tunnels right now. Let's get orange involved in that shape, yeah? Uh, there was a couple suggestions in the comments that I should have, at least for the special lines or the special shapes, multiple lines hitting that so it's not just uh, all being sent through one line. So now... Instead of the yellow line having to take the teardrops, the yellow or the orange line can move those shapes for us. Orange is getting a little heavy, uh, so probably want to get a second train on that here soon. Looks like we're almost through Sunday. Uh, we'll take a locomotive and, well, we'll do the carriage. And let's pause for a second, and we'll take the orange out to the triangle here. And then we'll have the orange and this extra carriage there. Go ahead and hit the play button again. And that orange train should help out a little bit as well. Uh, that circle there, do we want the green line to get it? Let's, um, okay, let's do this. Let's get the yellow and the green line involved. We're going to try and really mix these. And then we're going to have the green line come up and hit that diamond. And since the yellow is already using a tunnel, let's get the yellow involved there. Ooh, maybe when we get another tunnel, we can loop the yellow. Yeah, let's think about that. We might loop the yellow here once we get enough uh, tunnels. We're at 275 people moved, almost through Thursday. 
nothing too crazy happening so far or yet. Um, that green line has four circles in a row. I'm not necessarily thrilled about that. It's about to have a fifth circle in a row. Actually, I might bisect the blue line, have the blue line come here, and then let's have the blue line, um, actually, no, let's back off. We'll have the blue line hit this circle as well, that square, and then we'll have it help out the yellow line, especially since we're about to loop that yellow line. Uh, we're on to Sunday now. We'll take the locomotive, and then we'll go ahead and take the tunnels, and then we're going to go ahead and plop that train on the blue line there. Luckily, the blue line really only has one station of its own, uh, and it looks like the yellow line's gonna need to come out and hit that circle, and that's okay, because we're gonna do this, this, and then bring it up like that, and the yellow line is now a nice loop. Hopefully that uh, makes its life a little easier. This yellow, or that circle station there is getting quite a bit of buildup on it. I wonder why. Um, the blue line's stopping there. The hopefully the green and yellow aren't just bypassing it, are they? I think that's just the tunnels. Uh, I bet you those stations are filling up pretty pretty heavily. All right, let's see what the blue line does there. Hopefully the green picks up something, no? Yes, okay, green picked up a little bit down there. Uh, Friday, we're gonna have to wait to the end of the week Friday. We'll probably bring the blue line out to grab that circle. We just don't have any tunnels down there to, to help with. Orange line just picked up a star. Montreal's getting crazy kind of quick. Um, I need this week to end so I can get another tunnel here soon. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I need um, Sunday to end very quickly. Um, that yellow circle's chirping at us at as well. All right, we'll take locomotive and we'll take the tunnel. And let's go ahead and put the blue line down there. And then we're going to put a second train on the blue line. Actually, let's just um, do that there. And it can help get that squared away. That square. All right, so that yellow station there is getting heavily overloaded as well he's only gonna be able to pick up one um let's just get the green line involved there too till we get this squared away uh orange line will have to pick that circle up oh, are we gonna lose here i think we are uh that was a poor that was an extremely poor showing oh golly let's try that again shall we okay let's get the green line going here triangle square circle looks beautiful double up our speed here Oof, okay. Uh, what did we learn from that? We learned that there's going to be quite a bit of spawning and we need to stay on top of it. Let's go ahead and get the orange line going there. Just like that. Perfect. And we got to figure out... Hmm, I wonder if that station was just a super heavy spawner. We should have recognized that sooner and had the green line been involved a little quicker than we did. Um, we're going to have two triangles in a row. Let's have the orange line head up that way. Pick that triangle up there in the northeast corner of the map. About 20 people moved and almost done with the first week. Can't remember if I said it yet, but I'm, I know I said like and subscribe, uh, like every YouTuber says. But, uh, you know, don't forget to comment down below anything you like, don't like about the videos. Always wanting to hear feedback from you guys. And actually been getting some pretty good feedback, and I appreciate that. Got a poll on the website or the YouTube page right now. Um, kind of talking about what you guys like and don't like. Do you like a lot of edits and jumps? Do you like minimal edits and jumps? And so far, it seems like most people really like the, the minimal edits where I just kind of play through. And whatever I get is whatever I give you guys. Um, and let's just go ahead and put this other green train there too. Uh, and I'm okay with that. One, it makes my life easier. I don't have to do too many edits. And two, I think it just kind of shows exactly what the what the games offer. If I just start jumping around and showing you guys the highlights, you're, you're probably, you know, the game might look good, but um, am I really showing you exactly what the game is if I'm just showing the highlights? So I think I agree with you guys um, that we'll just leave it the, the way we're doing it right now, and we'll uh, keep the uh, minimal edits going, and um, yeah, people seem to be enjoying that. We'll go ahead and get the green line involved there. This station or this square is spawning quite a bit. Uh, so I think I have an idea of what I want to do here once this weekends and hopefully I get another, well, I'll get another train. So I think I'm going to take the yellow line and go boom, 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 there. And then maybe come down and hit this triangle. Never mind. We're going to take it off this triangle and we'll have it dip down and hit that triangle. So we'll get the locomotive and then we'll go ahead and take 
the carriage will be more impactful at this point. So let's go ahead and drop that yellow there. And since the orange line seems to be the heavy spawner, we'll get a second uh, carriage on it. So now we got two trains, double carriage trains on the orange line, two single trains, two single subways on the green line, and then just the single subway on the yellow line. The yellow line really only has two stations of its own. So we got that going for it. I wonder, should I drop that yellow line down to this triangle? Yeah, let's do that. And since we got the extra tunnel, let's, um, well, hold on. Uh, yellow line's gonna pick up that diamond. Do I want the green line to go and get that diamond? Um, no, I don't think so. I might do like our next line, we might do a bisect again. We'll see. And we got a circle out there. Uh, I might, I think I got another idea for our next line. It's gonna, we're gonna get some spaghetti going here, but we're gonna try and really get multiple lines going through multiple stations. Uh, almost through Sunday here, about 200 people moved. Um, we're doing, doing decent. What I end like 540 something. We'll take the locomotive. Ooh, we only get a carriage. Okay. Um, so we'll go ahead and pause for a second and let's just get the orange line involved there. Let's put the carriage on the the yellow train when he comes by. There we go. Since he's going to have to move all those diamonds, I want him to have that heavy, be able to carry quite a few things there. There we go. He's picking up a lot of diamonds. He's going to drop those off. Perfect. The orange line has, I guess, let's go ahead and put our other train on the yellow line for now. Yeah, just to, to keep it working. There's no reason to hold it in storage and not not have it moving passengers around. All right, um, let's do this and do, do, do that. There we go, we'll get the yellow and the green line up there. And then we'll have the orange line dip down here. Uh, and then we'll also have, we'll have the yellow line dip down and hit that circle as well. Okay. So everything's running through the square in the center. And I think every line also has at least, other than the diamond, obviously, every shape in it. So let's see if something like this works. I'm also considering, uh, if this was a triangle here, I might do it. And kind of this last green station in the northwest. But I, I think I'm going to leave that be. Orange line has quite a few heavy spawners on it. Um, do I want the other line? Yeah, I'm going to take the other line. And what I think I'm gonna do is we're gonna pause. Ooh, there's a pentagon out there. Okay, let's go blue line to the square. And then since this seems to have some heavy spawning here, and we'll hit here, and then we'll come out and hit the pentagon there. And then um, we might as well just hit that circle there. Um, there's quite a bit of chirping there. Ooh, and now there's a teardrop on the orange line. Okay, blue line's also gonna hit that teardrop to help out there on the orange line. And now we got a circle way out there in the middle of nowhere. We do have an extra tunnel, so guess what, blue line? You're gonna have to run down and grab that. Uh, yellow line will hit the triangle there, and we'll have the blue line hit the triangle, because I don't think there's any triangles on the blue line right now. Uh, so that will aid it. Probably need to get, we definitely need another train on the blue line. Um, Orange line and yellow line can come out and hit this circle. 435 people moved Friday, I think, afternoon, evening. Okay, we're on to Saturday. So that's, we got that going. Green line's pretty short. Um, let's just have the green, oh, we don't have any tunnels. Okay. Um, green line will eventually get the circle, but we need to get tunnels here in a second uh, to get the green line across there to help out. Oh, man, this orange line's really got quite a few spawners. This is also, ooh, yellow line has some heavy spawning on it too. Okay. Uh, and we don't have tunnels, but we got a carriage. So let's figure out where we can get a tunnel back. Um, where can we get, what line can I unhook and get a tunnel back? Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. How do I want to do this? I mean, blue line would make some sense. Bum, bum, bum. Uh, green line would make some sense too, uh, but then the yellow line would have to pop out and hit that triangle there. Um, okay, let's do this. Let's rework it. Thank God we're not in the hardcore mode, right? Because uh, we would be uh, SOL, and we'll have the green line come out there, and then yellow line's just going to have to pick up this circle. Um, and we're going to go ahead and hit play, and then I'm going to 
uh, see what happens here. I'm going to hang on to this. Okay, green line will pick up that square there as well. Okay, the trains were able to figure out what they needed to figure out. I think the yellow line's probably going to get at least another carriage on it. Yeah, the carriage is going to go on this other train here. So that'll help there. We're dumping a lot of diamonds down there. Why are we dumping all the diamonds down there, guys? I don't know. Okay, that yellow train's picking up a lot of those shapes. All right. Okay, things seem to have calmed down. Let's go ahead and put the other train on the blue line because the blue line is kind of long and it hits a couple of special shapes by itself. It doesn't have too much crossover. Um, and we'll get that blue train going there and it can kind of help out as needed. We haven't seen any interchanges pop up, which would be kind of nice at this point. I would really, really appreciate that. Um, okay, orange train's going to go out there and pick a bunch of stuff up. Yellow line's just going to have to pick that triangle up down there. Um, I wonder if, no, yellow line's getting pretty long at this point. We probably shouldn't do too much. All right, green line will pick that circle up. Yeah, I hear you chirping. 684 people. Uh, yellow line, okay, locomotive. Um, and we still don't have any tunnels. We'll take the carriage. I don't know how we're going to get to that circle. Because uh, we have zero tunnels. Um, and we just finished the week. Okay, let's... We're going to have to put our yellow train there. And let's just go ahead and put the carriage on it. It's got to stem the bleed there. Stem the bleed, whatever the word is I'm looking for right now. Um... I mean, the only thing I can think of is to reduce the blue line and have the orange line maybe go out there and get that circle. Um, so I guess that's what we're going to do. We're going to unhook all this, drop that back like that, um, and then we'll have the orange line come up and grab that. That's I think that's our answer at this point because we can't, can't do much else. So yellow line's really working that northern part out. Okay, um, we'll have it wrap around. Uh, we might be ending early again, and wowzers. How did I get over a 1,000 that one time? I must have just either been like on the top of my game or something. All right, hopefully this orange train gets up there and takes care of that. It looks like it will. All right, it's going to pick up all those passengers. Uh, green line's getting a little overworked now too. But I don't have any tunnels to really send another line over there. Uh... Saturday. Hopefully we can get another train and a uh, carriage here. Uh, it's going to be tight. I don't know if I'm going to be able to stop this green one from ending. Nope, we're going to lose here on this green one. 915, 916. 915 passengers. Okay, Montreal, you were rough. Um, I don't know what I would have done differently there at the end, obviously, than other than just starting fresh. Uh, so let me know down in the comments below if you have any other ideas what I could have done differently. I tried tried a little different strategy. We had a lot of overlap, uh, but I think we just didn't have enough tunnels to do exactly what I wanted to do, which maybe means we do less lines but more trains on each line. I don't know. That's uh, Again, let me know down in the comments, and we can come up with a better strategy for when we redo Montreal. Thank you so much for coming out and watching this Tooth and Scrubs video. I appreciate your time. I appreciate you guys. Appreciate all the comments and support I've been getting. Again, don't forget to like and subscribe, comment on down below on anything you want, and we'll see you in the next video.